Hi guys, this is George back here with another video and welcome to another news update where today we have got some new information of Project Exodus. I say today, it's going to be yesterday by the time you're actually watching this video. So, we have had some new information about mainly the being the first public rider. So this is mainly an annual pass kind of news update. So if you're not an annual pass, then get one because... If you want to be the first public riders of this coaster, you're going to have to be a pass holder. And we're going to talk all about what uh, all this whole new information is going to be about. But we've also had some news from Thought Park as they have now confirmed that Project Exodus's manufacturer will be Mac Rides. We knew that it was probably going to be by looking at the concept art of this ride. You look at all of the plans and it does look like Mac track. It also looks like their trains as well with the lap bars. So there have been uh, very strong rumours going around pretty much ever since we first saw the plans that it was going to be a Mac coaster. However, now it is confirmed that it will be. Of course, if you're not familiar with Mac rides, they uh, manufactured rides such as Icon at Blackpool Pleasure Beach, what's currently my favourite roller coaster in the UK. They also have done uh, a few different hyper coasters as well. They've done one in Australia, DC Rivals hyper coaster. They've also done one in Turkey at Land of Legends. I actually went on that a few months ago and it was an absolutely incredible roller coaster. So hopefully we're going to be seeing something like that with Project Exodus in terms of how the elements feel and how free you feel on the train. Of course, we know it's going to have the lap bars that Mac do. Uh, so you are going to feel very free on this ride. And it's got some big inversions just like hyper coaster at Land of Legends does. So very exciting to see that but now I'm going to talk all about this brand new club 236 so if you're wondering why it is called club 236 the reason why is because Thought Park's brand new roller coaster is going to be 236 feet tall making it the tallest roller coaster in the UK and it is also going to be the tallest roller coaster that Mack rides have ever built so that is very exciting the tallest roller coaster uh, they've currently built that's in operation is over in China at Suzhou Forest World that's a launch coaster so uh, it's something quite different what we're going to be seeing uh, to Project Exodus but in terms of Club 200 or 236 so we're going to talk all about this now. So, Club 236, if you are part of this club, you have the possibility of riding the first public train of Project Exodus when it opens in, which we assume, 2024. So, one visit, per, one visit to the park this year is going to be one entry. So the winners are going to be selected at random. The more times you visit the park, the more chances you're going to have of winning, basically. So there are four different tiers of prizes that you can win, and not all of the prizes have been announced, but the most important part of the prize has been announced. So we're going to start off with tier four. So tier four is the worst prize, and then it gradually goes up to the best prize. I say worst prize, tier four is, would still be absolutely amazing. So tier four, there's going to be 50 names picked for tier four. And if you are a winner of tier four, you'll get four tickets uh, to ride Project Exodus before the general public. So, you'll be allowed to go into the queue before uh, the rest of the public do on opening day, therefore you're not going to be queuing to ride it, you're going to be queuing 5-10 minutes max to get on this coaster, as there's only going to be 200 maximum people at this point. This is pretty much early ride time for Project Exodus, but for a limited amount of people. Tier 3, we have Oh, and also for Tier 4, if you want to win, be applied to win Tier 4, you need to visit the park once. That's all you need to do. Obviously, the more times you visit the park, the more chances you're going to have of winning. All you need to do is scan your pass at the entrance, and that will be uh, your one visit done. So you can literally just scan your pass, walk in there, get a coffee, and then walk out again, and that would still count as an entry. So, yeah, there's going to be a lot of visits like that to Thought Park for me this year. I'm just I'm going to be going in there as often as I possibly can. Even if we're just driving past on the way somewhere else, I'm going to be in there scanning my pass. Tier 3. So if you're a winner of Tier 3, you will get a pre-allocated seat on the first public train of Project Exodus. This will be valid for two people, so of course you'll be, they'll be yourself and then you'll get to take one other person with you as well. Pre-allocated seat, so you won't get to choose it. 
This also includes an overnight stay in the Thorpe Shark cabins the night before the event. You also get dinner and breakfast included with that and also fast track to use throughout the day. Uh, to enter to win tier 3, visit at least once, exactly the same as tier 4. With tier 2, this is where it gets a bit different now. So, tier 2, if you win tier 2, then you will get to choose which row you sit on on Project Exodus from rows 2 to 10. Of course, 10 is going to be the back, 2 is obviously second from the front. You'll get to choose between all of those rows. It'll be for two people, so yourself and one other person. Uh, it'll also be the same in terms of hotel. You'll get the stay in the Thorpe Shark cabins. You'll get the meals included for that and also fast track. To win tier two, you have to be the pass holder that visits the most in 2023 between the start of the season and the end of the season. So yeah, you're gonna have to visit a lot to win that one because I guarantee there's gonna be a lot of people going in there, scanning their pass this year and making their visits to Thorpe Park trying to win this. And then of course we have tier one, which is the best prize. So if you are the lucky winner of tier one, then you will get to be the first to ride on the first public train in the front row of Project Exodus. So of course for tier two, you get to choose between rows two and 10. If you win tier one, then you will get to sit on the front of this brand new roller coaster in the first train, which is very exciting. This is valid for two people, of course yourself and someone to bring with you. So, to win tier one, in fact, we'll go through the rest of the prizes. So the rest of the prizes are the same as the others. Overnight stay in the Thorpe Shark cabin, meals included, and also fast track. To win tier one, you need to visit at least once during each event of the park. So, of course, in 2023, Thorpe Park are going to be holding four events, Mardi Gras, Carnival, Oktoberfest, and Fright Nights. If you want to win tier one and be the first ride in the front row, of Project Exodus, you need to visit at least once during every event. Of course, if you uh, visit during each event, that'll be four entries if you visit once during each event. However, of course, the more times you visit, the more entries you'll get, but it does have to be during each event that you make a visit. So you will have to visit at least four times to be uh, eligible to win tier one. But of course, that is extremely exciting. So of course tier two is kind of more focused on uh, probably locals that at the park, people that are going to be going in all the time and then uh, can just like maybe walking distance from the park. Tier one, anyone could win this. All you need to do is visit for all four events and you'll have a chance of winning, which is very, very exciting. Somebody is going to be riding in that front row seat on Project Exodus's opening day on the first ever train before any uh, one else of the general public and it's going to be very very exciting it could be you watching it could be me for all I know the chances are very small there's only going to be two people of course but we're going to see what happens and it's certainly very very exciting so that is everything that has been announced so far for club 236 at Thorpe Park Resort So then guys, that is now the end of this video here. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure to follow me on Instagram at George Kelly, follow me on Twitter at George Kelly, and check out my other YouTube channel at George Kelly. Thank you very much for watching. Stay safe everyone and I'll see you all later. Bye.